Preparing a meal can offer an opportunity to get in touch with yourself. And Videhi is going to share her ideas about the art of conscious cooking with her vegan dinner party menu. Eating healthy is an integral part of living a healthy lifestyle. And one of the diets that we've really seen increase over the last couple of years is veganism. The only problem is it is really hard to find a vegan meal. So today, Videhi is with us and she's going to show us an easy way to create a fully vegan dinner. So Videhi, what are we starting with? Today I'm making sweet corn bites. To get started, let's turn on the gas. We're going to add in a drop of oil. The temperature is just ready. Add our mustard seeds, some cumin seeds. Add curry leaves very quickly. We're going to add in our chilli. You can smell those nice aromas. Yes. And remember, when we want flavour, we add our curry leaves to the oil. Here we're going to give this a little stir to get the flavours nicely incorporated into the corn. We're going to season with some salt. Okay, can you please pass me the peppers? Of course. I'll toss this in. What I love about this dish is the pop of colours that we get from this. Can you just pass me the pepper? Thank you. Let's get sprinkled. And it's now time for plating. Can I get all those colours and goodness in here? Oh, it looks fabulous. Doesn't it? The nice thing about using sweet corn is that it gives you that little bit of a bite with the chili and the yeah. aftertaste, the sweetness. Absolutely. We're going to garnish now with our coriander leaves. And how about a bit of a taste? In I would absolutely love that. Mm. Well, if this is just the starter, I'm looking forward to the menu. What's on the menu? Today I have a rack of collie with a coconut and tamarind jus. Sounds very exciting. We're going to start with making our jus. We're going to add our oil. We're going to add in some star knees. Yeah. Pop in our cinnamon sticks. We're going to be adding our mustard seeds. Now we're going to be adding our curry leaves. We're going to toss in our onions. And we want to cook this just until it gets a little bit soft. We're going to pop in our chilies and our babies. We're going to add in our garlic and ginger and quickly add in our tomatoes. And now Priya, we're just going to add in a bit of thyme. We're going to give this a rough chop. Now it's time for the garam masala and this is what adds the punch of flavour. Then we have the turmeric. And we're just going to add some salt. We're going to turn up the heat now. And we're going to be removing the hard bit. The bay leaves, your cinnamon sticks and your star anise. This we're going to take and pop it into our blender. Oh, that's perfect, friend. Now we're going to start with our cauliflower. We just cut this in half. Then we're going to season this with some garlic and onion powder. And now we have some chili powder, which brings out some flavour, adds some heat and some colour, of course. Now we're going to pop this into the pan. There we go. And we can just spoon over the oil to get in all those flavours. I'm going to try to turn it around because we want a nice roast on this. And this is exactly what we're looking for, a golden crust. We're going to pop in our seasoning again. Now we're going to add this to our pan. And we want to get every last bit in there. We're going to turn on the heat. Can I have the coconut milk, please? I can give you that. Perfect. We just want to give this a good stir and we want to get all those spices incorporated into this jus. We can add now the tamarind. The tamarind is actually going to balance out the sweetness of the coconut milk. Place this here. Place our cauliflower. Then we're going to spoon on some more gravy. Can you please pass me the steamed veggies? There we go. Right, perfect. I'm going to place a piece of broccoli and a slice of carrot and sprinkle over some peas. We're going to be garnishing with some pea shoots. One thing that's always fascinated me is how to make a vegan cake. Because that means no eggs, no milk, no butter. And Videhi's going to show us how to do it right now. And Kriya, I have one more surprise for you. Did you notice that I do not even have a dairy-free alternative in this recipe? That I'm using water instead of almond milk or soy milk. 
I think you need to show us how to do this. Absolutely. So the oil is actually what's going to add that moisture to the cake. Our lemon juice. It actually binds the cake well and adds that nice fluffiness to it. And a bit of vanilla. Start giving this a good whisk. We can add our sugar, which I've already sifted. Our cocoa powder has been sifted as well. Baking soda. And a half a teaspoon of salt. We're going to give this a good mix. And now we just want to create a little well in the center and we're going to pour in our wet ingredients. Mix this together and get all that goodness in. This is perfect now. So I'm just going to get my baking tin and we're going to pour this nicely in the center. We're just going to bang this down and this is going to get our cake nice and level. Are we ready for the oven? Yes, we are. We're going to bake this for 30 minutes and now we're going to start with our chocolate ganache. Oh, I'm excited. How do we do this? We're going to turn on the heat, pour in the coconut milk. We're just going to bring it to a boil just until it starts to simmer. And now we're going to pour this into the chocolate. And don't be tempted to mix. We just want it to melt first. You can try to mix this now. And then get that all incorporated. There we go. Now that the ganache is done, it's time to check our cake. All right, this has risen beautifully. And we just want this to cool down a bit before we add our ganache. The cake is nice and cool. We're just gonna loosen the sides. I'm gonna pop the cake out onto the plate. And now we're gonna pour on the ganache from the center. Wow, just look at that decadent chocolate lava flowing. And now, finally, we're just gonna place some berries. And now with the strawberries. Okay, are you ready, Kriya? I definitely am. That looks fabulous. Okay, cool. This looks absolutely amazing. I am so envious of your guests tonight because they are in for a vegan treat. Oh, Kriya, please do join us. <laughs> <laughs>